Welcome to EdTech Hustle. Today, we're going to use some Canva magic again. This time, I'm going to be showing you a new AI app called Canva Magic Expand. Let's go ahead and get started. So I've been playing around with a brand new tool inside Canva, and that is called Magic Expand. What that will do is it will allow you to take a photo like this, which is a square, and using AI, you can expand this photo to fill the entire slide. So we can essentially convert this photo from a square into a rectangle. So it's kind of interesting. So what I'm going to do is select the photo. We're going to go to edit, and here is one of the new features. It's called Magic Expand. I'm going to select that, okay? And you can see that it starts out in this expand mode. There's this option, which is freeform, that allows you to just select how big you want that area to be filled uh, with, this, with this new feature. The other one is this option. This is the whole page. So I'm just going to select that whole page and I'm going to select Magic Expand. In a few moments, you should see Canva Magic doing its work. Okay, here we go. You can see to the left, there's four different results for this. Go ahead and take a look at this, you can see that Canva was able to kind of recreate the skyline, that which is exactly what I was going for. Now, if you look kind of closely, you can see some, some a little some images that are a little bit irregular that don't quite look right. But again, if this is just something that you're using in the background of a video or in the background of a slide, if you look quickly, if you glance at it fast, you won't really be able to tell. Here's another option. Looks a little bit different. A few others as well. So not bad. I kind of think I like this first option the best. I think it works really well with these type of images. Let's try this again. Here's another way that you can use this tool. This is an image of a teacher, but as you can see, his arm is kind of cut off. And if I wanted a little bit more of, of his body, underneath where this tie is. I have no way of really doing that. But you can use Magic Expand. And let's see what's going to happen. I'm just going to select Magic Expand. Again, I'm going to fill the whole page. And let's see what Canva Magic is able to create. So here are our results. You can see that Magic Expand was able to not only expand the background of this chalkboard, but it even recreated the bottom of our model right over here. You can see it, it finished up the sports coat. It tried to extend his tie, give him a, a nice matching pair of pants, as well as an elbow and shoulder, which wasn't there before. So again, if you look closely, you can kind of see the lines where Magic Expand kind of did its thing. But if you're looking at this closely, or if you're looking at this quickly, I should say, you won't be able to tell. Let's see a few other options. Here's a little bit of a different pair of pants. I think the tie might look better. Pants look a little bit wrinkled. There's a line uh, at the bottom right over here as well. Let's go ahead and take a look at this one. <laughs> Not really too bad. It kind of looks like he's uh, bending his knee a little bit, posing for that photo. And this one, not really so good. But I do think that this looks pretty cool. Let me show you one final example. I have a photo here of a car and you can see it's almost a rectangular 16 by nine ratio. What happens if I wanna take this and maybe post it on Instagram? That's really that square one-to-one -one format. So I typically can't do this without sacrificing some of the, the, the space on the car. I'd have to cut that car out or leave a lot of space at the top or the bottom. Well, with Magic Expand, I can expand that to this one-to-one -one ratio right over here. Now when I select expand, go ahead and take a look at this option. I think this looks pretty good. Some other options as well. 
think I like this first one the best. I'm just going to select done. Now when I kind of scale it down a little bit, I have an image that I can post on Instagram that's going to preserve the car in this one photo. So here's what my photo looked like before. Here is Magic Expand kind of doing its thing. So I should let you know that there's a number of different ratios that you can use aside from one to one. That Canva will automatically resize by using this new feature, Magic Expand. So I hope this video has been helpful for you. If you don't have Magic Expand in your Canva account, you will very soon. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have questions, you know what to do. Leave them in the comments section below.